de Ron Wang. It's great that uh, Takam's here because he's, you know, loved the right dimensions for Parker and he comes with like a lot of bent arm shots, like uppercuts and hooks and he comes forward and he's doing, he did eight rounds with me today, which was like great work for the both of us. I fight a little bit like a Joe, like a Parker, I'm more fast. Parker is a guy in the ring, you don't want to catch him because he always moves left, right, left, right, throw the jab. So I try to work with that. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. Joe Joyce is like it's like an engine. You know, when he start, he cannot you cannot stop him. Bam, 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 non-stop. Sometimes I wonder like I can see his jab coming, but I still take it. You hit him with everything you've got, and trust me, I've hit him with some big, big shots. And he's like, he just resets and walks back and keeps coming and keeps coming and keeps coming. <laughs> Beautifully. We always get good in intense work, and I think that's why Joe likes having me back. Salas likes it because he knows that I'll bring a, bring a bit of heat, and uh, yeah, I'm not afraid to get stuck in. And sometimes you need a bit of that crash bang wallop sparring. Nice. Woo! When you fight Joe Joyce, you've got to be prepared to go 12 rounds because. It's going to go the distance if you're going to beat him. That's the only way. You've got to beat him on the distance, and I don't think that's going to happen on in September. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It's like practice fighting, isn't it? So, um, but also you're kind of working on things that Salas wants from me. He's calling out stuff that, like, in between rounds and sometimes during, like, what I need to do and what I need to work on and just remind me of things so I can practice in there. Beautiful, Joey. Yeah, do something. Yes, that's good. Thank you. I love the way you do. Yes, beautiful too. You know, we've got our game plan going in there. We watched the a tape of him. I've got a plan and in my head where I can capitalize and land shots on him and what the, the danger punches he's gonna throw and how to like react and counter to them. Do him, Joey. Do him. Yes, yes. Joey Nuts. Joey Nuts. Joey Nuts. Joey Nuts. Let's go. Joey Nuts. Please be forward. Catch your counter. Go. Any punch goes, can't wait, can't wait. Ten more rounds, ten more rounds. Well done. What is fine, man? I had fun in there, I'm sure he did, and yeah, it's really great to have him have him here in Vegas. You know, it's not the first time I've done that. Like I like when I got on GB I beat Fraser Clark and then I literally shared a room with him. So some boxers you can be friendly with, but then when it comes to fight like Joseph Parker, like I'm friendly with him and, and Fury and you know, but when once you get in the ring then you have to, you know, have a different mindset because it's a comp it's a competition and you're against that your opponent and you wanna win. So you could shake hands afterwards basically. <laughs> Uh, it's going to be a really good fight between Joyce and Parker. It's really going to be really ex exciting fight. I, I can't wait to see that fight, really. I can't wait to see that. I think it's going to be a great fight because he's hard to hit and he comes forward. He's got great, good power and um, head movement and footwork. And so it's going to be a bit more of a technical thing. He'll, he'll be the best like, level opponent I've faced so far. I believe you, you will do more. You will do more. No, not every heavyweight do what you did. You move to size. Only you. This is one of your best thing you have. Since I saw you first time, I, I, you, yeah, you are very good to that size. 